Hello friend, welcome. So this is our Android project for uh, chess written in Kotlin. Let's continue with our um, game board printing. Okay, so we already have an empty one. And now uh, we are working on putting the pieces, initial 32 pieces on it. Okay. Um, so we are here, the two string method output a dot for every intersection on the board. So now it's time to handle this one, right? And uh, we want to check if um, a specific intersection location on the board, right? Um, if there's a, a piece or not. So let's create our, let's close this one. Um, yeah, let's create our helper function, piece at. Okay, so we'll introduce the nullable thing, the concept in Kotlin. Um, nullable in Swift is called optional. It means it can be, it can be nil or now, or it can be an object. So, fun function piece at. Okay, so we need to provide the parameters of column and row, right, to check a specific location. So it will return our chess piece like that question mark because it can be now this is nullable okay so what is the logic to check that we'll loop through our pieces box right to see which one uh, if anyone meets matches this location okay so for like a um, piece in pieces box okay then if colon is the same as piece dot colon and row equals piece dot row then we know we we, we find this piece right so we can return piece this guy so after everything after the for loop if we still don't find it we return oh there's an option here return now cool okay so with piece add we can use the here let's use the piece add function to get our piece out here so wow value value piece equals piece at right colon and the row this co this row and uh, this column okay so now this is a nullable um, value okay so we will need to check if piece is now then we can do this right we just put a dot there otherwise we need to check it's um is rent so we use when when is is a switch something like a switch in other program language so p is dot rank now um the first case is um, chess piece dot king, okay, like that, and we can put the code here. Mm, what do we do if it's a king, right? So we do it. Um, D E S C plus equal. Um, so if if piece dot player is same as uh, 
which has player no shares player dot white right if it's white that append r mm, king okay k else otherwise is uh, capitalized because we we don't want to duplicate the the space here let's do something if yeah so it means here the piece is not is not now so we can append a space here now we can get the, the duplication from here okay so this is the king now we can make a copy of that so for queen queen will add our q here and uh, capitalize q for black now the other one is um, the bishop bishop so hmm so this is duplication duplicated okay so we can we can define the value um, like if like white equals this guy right cut yeah so we can use white here if white can we remove that nope what did he say add the place to if statement no we don't need that if white 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 yeah why not I think this is better and this one it will be rook so R and uh, R another one is Knight. Okay, so we cannot use K here. Let's use N because K is occupied by the king. The last one is pawn. Okay, easy P and uh, P. So what 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 does he complain? Leave the assignment out of when, okay? Like that. Okay. So this. Oh. Okay, that's cool. No problem with that. Mm hmm. And. Uh, now let's run it so we should be able to see our piece here because we have a white rook here hopefully it works let's clean up this guy oh here oh yeah run it yes it works you see and uh, what is this one? Function PZ could be private. Yeah. It, um, okay, for now, let's make it private. Okay. No problem. And if we create another one here, like a black, a black one. 
put it on row 7 let's see okay uh, run again yes you see very good right that's it thank you for watching see you next time